I did my undergrad degree in business administration in the UK, after which I worked in advertising for a year. But then I also realized that that wasn't for me. And an opportunity came knocking at my door where my friend was going to an ashram for a yoga retreat for a month. But over there, I ended up working in the kitchen, cooking for everyone. And that's what ignited my passion for cooking and brought me to Sydney, Australia to study commercial cookery. So I had secured a job at Google as a chef. And while I was chefing at one of the events, it was a data and analytics event, one of the Googlers said to me that data is the new oil and it's the future. And that's what made me believe that I wanted to be a part of that future. And it made me enroll in the Master of Business Analytics at Kaplan Business School. So I did my academic internship via Korea Central and it was for a property tech company. It was called PropBite. And the beauty of this company was that it actually honed the power of analytics to make business decisions. Um, I thought it added a lot of value in terms of my degree and experience in analytics as well. I think the KBS lecturers are absolutely amazing because they tend to give you a very personalized approach towards teaching. Having studied at a university in the UK, for example, it was this huge hall with 50 to 100 people and it was one lecturer talking at us. And I also feel like there was that fear to really put your hand up and ask questions. Whereas with KBS, there's more of that personalized approach. All of the lecturers know my name, for example. So I understand that career changes can be quite hard, but sometimes you've just got to do it. You don't want to wake up at the age of 70 and realize that you know, you've know you whiled away your life doing something that you didn't like doing. And it's never too late. I've changed my career twice now. I worked in marketing first, and then I worked as a chef, which I'm still doing, and now analytics. I think, I think just do it. Have the courage and do it, because you can. Yeah.